I'm not bald. Your mom. Your mom jokes are banned on this channel. Can you just do something else? It's trick or treat time, guys. Or I have to say on Eddie. Come on, boys. It's trick or treat time. Wait for me, zombie Elvis. Nice, aren't you? Oh, damn it. I am Luthor, Viking, protector of Mato Zumba. Oh, which you call this old geese called Jerry David? Aren't I? I forgot the line. He goes, Aren't I frightening? And then Ed kind of looks at him like. Actually, no, I think he goes like. Okay, he goes, um, like. Aren't I frightening? He's like, Her, in millions of years, I cause. Millions of deaths, and he's, I, he said, and then Ed, Ed's like, he says, I'm the Palak, and then at, and then Ed's like, what, like on your teeth? No! Yeah. <laughs> that was a good entry to the show of our little horror story. That was really, really good. Yep. I will think about that. Pretty good, good shot, though. Um. Yeah, this kind of... Hmm. This is funny, though. This is about a few... Probably a, a month before I met Nightfall, so this kind of hits in. I was still trick-or-treating, and I was just like... Because you know what? I really had, like, issues with my neighbors. And it really became a point to, you know, get out of the house. And plus, my bully was already gone by, like... By whatever. And me being the person, like, okay, well, you know... Now, I really don't care, and it's Halloween. I'm actually going with a group of friends, and my mom doesn't even care. My dad is working late. And plus, this was, like, way back in the, like, the seventh week before I met Nightfall. I went to Halloween today. Actually, no. I think I'm back. I think you're not Halloween yet, because, you know, the freaking Google 19. Yeah, and I lost my Uncle Frankie to it. Rip him. Pisses me off with this COVID bullshit. But, uh, other than that, let's just get back to the topic, though. Now, me and my friends, and apparently I, 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 I didn't just have, like, the girls with me and the guys. I also had some girls coming, because, I mean, people kind of, like, think I'm just, like, some girl with a bunch of god bodyguards. No, that is not what I am. Go down. Yeah, and I got 40 subs. Apparently, I kind of date back and be like, yo, now... The funny thing is, I was actually, um... I was raving from Teen Titans, though. Because this is really funny, though. Because... Oh, I love that show. Yeah, I was I, like I was, The funny thing is, I was Raven. I was not even. I'm not even joking. It was a really good costume. Oh, I like Raven. She won. I love her. I was her I, for Halloween. Oh, I know. I know. I was her for Halloween. And the funny thing is, um, my friend got me the wig and everything. And apparently, um, I guess um, the, the funny thing is, people were taking pictures, and I, at least they had my consent. So it was like trick or treat, and then. The funny thing is, some houses just gave me a bunch of candy than, like, my friends. Which I kind of felt bad, though. And yes, my friends in the group were actually Ed and Nettie characters, which was funny. Uh, my friend Gil was Ed, the dumb one. My friend Adam was Ed, uh, the... <laughs> who was the, um... Who is he? Okay. 
So my, so my friend, um, <coughs> Adam, he was the, the, the smart Ed boy, and then my friend Charlie was Eddie, the, uh, the third, the, I'm right back. the third one. You could, you could need the story, I'll be right back. Tell him when you get back. Other than that, my friend Danny, who was, I don't know. God, this is taking half of the show. Mm. So Gil was, um... Gil was, um, Gil was Robin, um, Adam was Cyborg, Charlie was Beast Boy, um, was on camera. Mm. Mm. Alright. Sorry about this, guys. Nightfall was busy. None of your business, why? I was doing my business. Yeah. Ah. Doing so in my teeth. Okay. Going through the costume lineup, I was Raven, Gil was Cyborg, Adam was Robin, and Daniel was uh, Beast Boy. Um, who was it? So my friend Luna was Starfire, and my uh, and my friend Yuri was Terra. We still count her as a Titan anyway, but we really just hate what Slade had done to her. So we kind of count her in as one of the Titans. And then, um, I believe Danny was Aqualad or something like that. I think that's his name, Aqualad or Aqua Boy in the show. Okay, so Danny was Aqualad. We had. We had, um, Jordan, he was, um, Cyborg? 
Raven? No. No, I was Raven. My friend Gil was... Was Robin? no, my friend Gil was cyborg. My friend Adam was um, my friend Adam was Robin, and my friend Charlie was Beast Boy, I think. So apparently, Danny, yeah, Danny was Aqualad. So not Aquaman, not Aqua Girl, Aqualad. Oh, um, oh, Jordan was, um, was, I think he was Kid Flash, who's like a basic version of the Flash. He was Kid Flash, um, oh, and, uh, Leonardo was Hot Spot, who was in the Teen Titans one. Yeah, and um, Don's girlfriend, who she was Jinx, which was funny. Funny thing is, okay. yeah, I'm trying to figure out who was, uh, yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot. Donatello was mammoth, I think. I think he was either mammoth. Well, uh, yeah. Uh, Harry was either um. Yeah, Harry was Red X, I think. Either he was mammoth, Red X, or. Yeah, he was definitely, I think he was Red X. I could have been wrong. He's very confusing, but Harry was Red X, which is kind of funny, though, because a lot of people think that Red X is mysterious, or Red X is really Robin. Who the f*** knows? Now, that's our little trick-or-treat thing. Now, this is a very long video, but, you know. So, we... we yeah, that's what Harry was for Halloween. He was Red X, and um, the funny thing is, um, at least we had um, a couple of it. But you know, me personally, I mean, I wish I was the Cheshire, the girl with the mask. Though her name is Cheshire, like the Cheshire cat in Wonder Alice in Wonderland, because her real name is actually Jade, which is funny though. I love it though. But uh. Yeah, I was talking about one of the Teen Titan villains, uh, Chezer, and she, she, um, So back to it, I guess we go trick-or-treating from door to door, and we get to this house, and we're like trick-or-treating in a cul-de-sac area. And I guess, um, this kind of gets weird. Like, really weird. So there's this couple, and I guess my friend, um, Gil rings the doorbell, or Funny Man, we call him. The funny thing is, he rings the doorbell and a lady answers, and she's just like, come on in, the candy's inside. Now, I told, I gave Gil an arm and said no, because I think she's trying to lure children in. Now, me being like a, like a 12-year-old, 13-year-old girl, I knew that this lady was freaky. Now, we slowly backed away, but apparently she was really angry. Next up, when we ran, like, the police had just dashed by us, and when we, like, peeked out of somebody's bush, we saw that the police were actually dragging her out of the house. 
So I guess that lady got arrested though, because turns out there were two kids locked in her basement crying. And that was so scary though, because those kids were like 5 and 10 years old. Yo. Yeah? So apparently when we went to that house, I said no to the lady, and apparently like, turns out when the police actually came, we ran and we ran like really fast, but then we saw the police dashing their cars really fast. And the funny thing is, the lady was getting dragged out, because it turns out, and then next up they go into her house, and there's two kids coming out in tears. One five-year-old, I think it was a boy, and a ten-year-old girl. I'm, think, I'm guessing their brother and sister. And their parents came out of the cop car because they were really scared. Pretty much for Halloween, I guess by like, we kind of like said, when we were like 17, we were renouncing trick-or-treating and that was it. We were done. We were, by the time we were 17 or whatever, we were done trick-or-treating. We were not having it, and apparently we were so done. By the time we all went home and parted ways, we all called each other to say, you know, we're home and safe. Next up, we started to FaceTime each other, because you know what? We all showed the candy that we got and the ones we threw out because we hated. I mean, to be honest, though, I hate gobblers. They're so... I don't know. Gobblers. I hate, um... I hate Whoppers. What else do I hate? Oh, God. I hate Taffy. Nightfall, do you have any candies that you hate? Yo. Yeah? Do you have any candies that you hate, like, you don't even want to eat or touch? Uh, I don't know. I don't really eat candy much. I'm older now. Yeah, well, I have a lot of candies I don't like. I don't like that much of Reese's, like, literally. Okay, I like Reese's. Uh, there's, I'm very picky with Reese's, because you already know why. Nuts, yeah. allergy. Don't worry about that. I know you mean that. Yeah, I'm very picky with it. I mean, you know, don't blame me because you know what? At least I no, take. No, no, it's okay. It's your, it's your allergy. I don't care. No, I'm talking to the camera because sometimes people don't even take allergies seriously. To be honest, though, oh my god! And I guess by the time you know this happened, I guess like Halloween, that lady it turns out she was actually. The house that that lady was in was vacant, and that basement was actually rotting. It was so scary, me and my friends decided to just, you know, meet up in one, some, one of our houses after school, and get our costumes on, get everything that we need, and that was that, you know, pretty much. Halloween, we still like, though. I mean, come on. I mean, I mean my cousin's birthday's on Halloween. My friend Marigold's birthday is on Halloween. I like the ho the ho the holiday. Um, Nightfall likes the holiday. Yo, it's a really good holiday though. But I'm not in. The, I'm not in. I just like the holiday because I like the good stuff about it. I don't like. I don't like the horror films. I don't like the shrills and giggles. That's not my type. Halloween is just I enjoy it. We don't like Halloween. I drink no hate that. I don't know it. I'm not but like, you know. Ever since then, by the time we were all 17, was the last time we all trick-or-treated. By the time we were 18, I guess we would just, like, go to go to someone's house. Um, whatever. <laughs> Yo, man. What the hell? Yeah. So, I mean, by the time we were all 17, we are just like, that's it. We're not trick-or-treating. Out. We were done. No, we were done trick-or-treating. Because apparently that house was so vacant that nobody lived there. And they were going to tear that house down. <laughs> by the time it was Halloween, like, when we were 18-year-olds, we would go to somebody's house. 
do, you know, we would just, like, you know, do whatever. But, you know, plus our parents were okay with it. Plus 18, you know, we're not really trick-or-treating. We're adults, so we can just do whatever the hell we want. My name is Jade, and I'm signing out. Yo, sign out. You underestimate my power. Don't try it. <sighs>